Debit Order Number 031, Series of 2019, otherwise known as the Department of Education Service Marks and Visual Identity Manual, 2018 edition contains guidelines on the specifications and applications of the department's name, seal, and logo to produce a unified look in all DepEd communications and publications. Here is the new template for DepEd employees' identification card as per Dep Ed Order Number 031, Series of 2019. The Dep Ed ID is vertical and has the size of an automated teller machine or ATM card. For the whole department, blue is for the third-level positions appointed by the President of the Philippines. Red is for the chiefs and other plantilla positions or regular items. And yellow is for the contracts of service and consultants. In front of the card, the DepEd seal and logo, name and photo of employee, employee number, and position are placed. At the back of the card, the employee's name and signature. Address and contact details of the company. Name and signature of the authorized personnel. And the statement, in case of emergency, please contact are written. A space for the employee's other information is provided too. Any employee who alters a photo ID card or who allows any card issued in his or her name to be used by any other person is subject to disciplinary action. Now, you may use the following templates in Microsoft Word and Adobe Photoshop. All you need to do is click and download the file then edit. The link is provided in the description down below. For Microsoft Word users, you may select from the three choices. Hover your mouse on any of the samples. Then right-click. Copy. And go to File Menu. Then Blank Document. You may adjust the page setup. Click on Layout tab, then customize the margins, orientation, and paper size depending on your needs. Then, on your keyboard, press Ctrl-V to paste. You may now edit the content to fill in the necessary information and add your picture. For Adobe Photoshop users, open the file. On the options bar, make sure to tick on the show transform controls. On the lower right hand side of the screen is the layers panel. If you cannot see the layers panel, just press F7 for the shortcut, or go to Window Menu, then Layers. Click on the chevron icon to collapse the front folder group. Collapse the text folder layer. Click on the surname layer. Then go to the Type tool, or just press T on your keyboard. Then, select the surname and rename it. Repeat the process for the name, office, position, employee number, and region or office. Click on the chevron icon to collapse the picture PNG format subfolder group. Click on the rectangle 3 layer. There are two ways to add picture in this folder. 
First, if your picture is in JPEG format, you may select that picture, then drag and drop to the document window. Right click on your picture layer, then create clipping mask. Then reposition or resize your image. Notice that the picture is clipped inside the rectangle as I move it. Let's delete this picture to show you the other way. Use the same process, but this time we will be using picture in PNG file format or picture with transparent background. Now, if you want to change the background color from blue to red, or blue to yellow, scroll down on the Layers panel and click on the Chevron icon to collapse the Change Color Here subfolder group. You notice that the blue layer is visible, and the red and yellow layer is invisible. Let's turn off the layer's visibility for blue and turn on for red. We now have a red background. Do the same process if you want a yellow background. If you're done with the front layout, go to File. Then save as. Create a file name. Save as type. Please select JPEG. And then click Save. For the back layout, we need to disable the visibility of the front layer. Click on the eye icon. Then, scroll down on the Layers panel. And turn on the Layers Visibility icon for Back Folder. Click on the Chevron icon for each subfolder to edit. Repeat the same process in saving the file. I hope you enjoyed learning our topic on editing DepEd Employees Identification Card. What can you say about our video tutorial? Share with us your thoughts in the comment section below. Be sure to check out the rest of my video tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.